Hi everyone, with Windows 8.1 due out anytime soon, I thought I'd just create a short video just to show uh, a few of you how you can upgrade your Windows Surface RT tablet uh, to the 8.1 preview to give you a bit of a sneak peek as to uh, what you can expect. Um, so first thing I want to do really is, is create a recovery drive um, on, on a USB pen just in case things go wrong and I want to revert back. Um, that's a fairly simple process and what you do is you swipe in from the right hand side, go into search, if you type in recovery, okay and then if you see the settings there, if you go into settings and then you want to choose recovery there. And what this will allow you to do is actually create a recovery USB stick. So if you go and tap on create a recovery drive. Okay. And this should be a fairly, fairly quick process. And there it's picked up. In fact, they've got a four gig USB pen in there. Click create. That's going to go ahead and format the hard disk and then copy everything across. Now what you want to do next is go to Internet Explorer and just type something on the lines of Windows 8.1 Preview. What we're going to be doing here is actually allowing you to update to the preview through the um, through this, the App Store to make it sort of uh, you know, pretty nice and uh, nice and simple for you. Um, okay, so we've gone uh, uh, to the 8.1 preview page, and it allows us to get an update. Okay, you click on that, and then you want to, we want to open that, and that's going to download. And then when that's done, we're going to run that. Okay, we'll go ahead and open that. And then all we'll do is we'll just follow the on-screen instructions. Say yes. Okay, now that's installed, we click on restart. Okay, once it's restarted, go ahead and log yourself back in. And then what we should be able to do this time, there we go, you see the message there, get the 8.1 preview from the store. So we go to store, and click on download. Now if you can see that was a, a 2 gig, 2.19 gig download. So this is going to take a, a few minutes, so uh, we'll let this run and we'll be back shortly um, when it's finished downloading. Okay, what well, seems to feel like an eternity, we are finally here. First time around it did error on me, so I've restarted and um, we're almost there. So we, it installs some updates and it restarts, does some more updates, restarts. They are quite, it's quite, quite a slow process, but finally we are there, so it's just going running through the standard setup which you get when you, when you normally do uh, you got Windows 8 for the first time. Windows apparently Windows 8.1 will be more integrated with the SkyDrive. Go 
Okay, so this is uh, Windows 8, 8.1 preview. Um, so initially it doesn't look a great deal different, but there are some changes. Um, one of them is the, uh, the the App Store has been redesigned. So if you go into it now, it's, it just looks looks a bit different. They've just uh, updated this. It's really just a cosmetic, cosmetic change. Um, it still starts to the Metro desktop, but you can now change that. Um, and the simple way to do it is if you go to your desktop, and then if you right click on the open space on the taskbar, go into properties, and then into navigation, you've got a couple of options just along here. Go to desktop instead of start when I sign in, you can put a tick into that. And that will then go straight to your desktop. Um, the other thing you'll notice is that down at the bottom, just here, there is what looks like a little start button. Now, initially, that you press on that, that just does what the, the Windows or start button on your keyboard does, just takes you back to the Metro desktop and back to the last app you were using. Uh, now, again, you can change that. Again, right click on the taskbar, into properties, navigation, and you can put a little tick in the boxes, show the apps view automatically when I go to start. And then what that does is basically give you all your apps. Not quite like the additional start button when you get your menu pop up at the side. This basically just shows you all your apps. Press it again, it goes back to your desktop. And I so say this screen can be pressed, you know, you can change the screen set. The, the option is more colours. I'm going to uh, into personalise, and you've got some more options here, and you know a lot more colours. You, you now can you can now choose. So it's a little bit more customizable. The other thing you can do is on your uh, lock screen. you can actually set up slideshow so it will just start showing you know photos and stuff uh, instead of you know just a static or a blank screen uh, anyway that is a very very quick look at how to install or up, you know upgrade to the preview version of windows 8.1 uh, thanks very much for watching please uh, feel free to you know post any comments below and uh, remember to subscribe to uh, get any uh, further updates thank you very much